Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, it's time to go over the worst album covers of the year. Uh, I did this uh, last year as well, so if you guys want to check out the worst album covers of 2021, link is in the description down below. Also, if you guys haven't checked out my most disappointing albums of 2022, go ahead and check it out. It's also in the uh, description down below. Uh, but yeah, this year, I'll be honest with you guys, this year, there wasn't that many bad album covers, you know? So I wasn't going to do this video this year because, again, there wasn't that many bad album covers. Like, there wasn't really bad album covers. Like, even the albums here are not bad. Like, the covers are not bad. But since this is kind of like a tradition for me, since I've been doing this for like five years now, uh, I've always done the worst album covers of the year. Uh, and I wasn't going to stop just because there wasn't that many bad album covers. Now, when I say worst album covers, I'm going off of all the albums that I've listened to this year. So I'm not going to pick an album that I haven't listened to just because it has a bad album cover. You know what I'm saying? So I'm only going off of all the albums that I've listened to this year. These are the worst album covers. I might even do a list of all the uh, albums that I've listened to this year. And, uh, and if I do, I'll leave it in the description down below just so all of you guys can see or could go through them and see all the albums I've listened to. But yeah, I'm just wasting uh, time here. So let's just get started with the list. Uh, coming in at number 10 is Don FM by The Weeknd. Uh, yeah, the reason why this one's on here is because uh, he released alternative album covers that were so, so much better than this one. Uh, and so that's why he's on here, because he had plenty of album covers to choose from. You know what I'm saying? And he chose the one with his face. I get it. You know, The Weeknd, if you go through his discography, all his albums are just his face on it. And I get it. But this Don FM cover just wasn't it. You know, he had album covers like this, like this, and he didn't use it. You know what I'm saying? He had album covers like this. And he didn't use it, bro. Come on now, like this. If he would have done something like this or the, or this, then it would have been in my best album covers of the year. But since he didn't, he stuck with uh, the other one. It just wasn't it. You know what I'm saying? It just wasn't it. Uh, coming in at number uh, nine is SoundCloud Days by PNB Rock. This one again. This one is not a bad album cover, but from all the other albums that I listened to this year. This cover has to be one of the worst. I get what PMB Rock was going for, you know, that SoundCloud vibe, you know, that SoundCloud album cover. I just, I'm not a huge fan of it. Just not a huge fan of it. Coming in at number eight is Ray Brown with his album. I can, can't even pronounce it. Is it X, you know? I don't know. Uh, yeah, this album cover is just, it's boring. It looks boring. The album is a bit boring. And with this album cover... I guess it kind of matches the album just because of how really bland the album sounds. Um, but again, I'm not a huge fan of the album or the album cover itself. Coming in at number seven is uh, Bible with 504 in. The reason why this one's on here is because I just feel like having your face on the album cover, I feel like that's just too lazy, you know, too easy, you know, and especially with the album being called Bible. It could have been a bit more creative with the album cover. Coming in at number six is Cash Page S2 S2 ML. Um Yeah, this one's also a bit too generic. That's why it's on here. It's not really like bad or anything, but just too generic. Uh and she's she has some good album covers in the past. She put out some good album covers. Um but yeah, this one's got to be her worst for sure. Coming in at number five is uh, Her Loss with Drake and 21 Savage. Uh, Drake is just on a run of putting bad album covers. Uh, 21 Savage actually has some good album covers, so I could tell that Drake picked this album cover. It wasn't 21 Savage. This was old Drake. And yeah, it just doesn't really work. I feel like with an album called Her Loss, I feel like they could have come up with something better than just uh what we got coming in and number four is life in hell with lancey fox with the album being called life in hell again i feel like he could have been a bit more creative 
But I don't know. Just Lancey Fox, he doesn't really have the best album covers. If you go through his uh, discography, all his other projects don't have that good of an album cover. So I wasn't really expecting much from Life in Hell, you know. Uh, I don't know. I just, again, I think he could have been a bit more creative with this one. And then now we're down to the top three worst album covers of the year. Coming in at number three is Drake. Honestly, never mind. He's just on a three album run of making bad album covers. Uh, this one's just too simple and too boring. I'm not a huge fan of the fonts that he used either, so it doesn't really help. It's good to have an album cover that's simple, but it has to be good. Coming in at number two is God Did with DJ Khaled. DJ Khaled, honestly, he doesn't have the best album covers, but this one has to be his worst for sure out of his old discography. I do love the memes that came out of this album cover, but other than that, this album cover is just funny to look at. I get what he was doing with this, but it just, I don't know. He could have come up with something better than this. You know, it's just, it's a funny, funny album cover for sure. And uh, the memes are funny. But yeah, this is a bad album cover. Coming in at number one, I will be getting hate from this. But uh, it's Yeet to Alive. Again, I'm not a huge fan of this whole SoundCloud album covers i'm just not a huge fan of this album cover and uh it, again it deserves to be on here uh but yeah that is all i have for today if you guys did enjoy this video go ahead and leave a like comment uh let me know your uh worst album covers of the year and uh, stay tuned for the best album covers of 2022 and until next time